Hey, everybody. Happy Monday. I hope it's going smooth, whatever you're doing, if you're working or if you're working at home or if you're relaxing or if you have the day off and you're recuperating from a long weekend at work because you do retail. <sighs> More power to you. And I just had a thought. Is anyone familiar with the term trauma dumping? I used to work with some girls and young ladies, and they were upset. They came in, ugh, this person totally trauma dumped on us. You don't just share your life story with people you just meet. And I was like, well, what happened? And they explained, and I was like, well, sounds like they're going through a rough time. And, you know, do you still live with your parents, have parental support? They're like, well, yeah. And I'm like... Well, it sounds like that person doesn't have parental support or live with their parents. So why are you judging on them? And how is it an inconvenience that they shared a truth in their life if they're going through a hard time? And they just kind of pause. Well, that just, it's just, you know, we don't, shouldn't have to deal with that. No one should just trauma dump. And it's like, the person sharing what they're going through in their life is what they're going through. Listen, empathize, be grateful you're not going through crazy stuff other people have to deal with. Hmm. So don't judge people for trauma dumping. Ah, maybe listen and empathize and grow up and then be grateful in your own story. See it as, oh my gosh, you can be supportive to someone and then you can be grateful for what you have or what you're not going through. Ah, just a thought. Don't judge people who trauma dump and maybe get rid of the term. We all can share our life story, how we overcome. That's how you help each other. And some people just need someone to listen to them because they don't have anybody. It doesn't hurt you to know people are going through serious shit as you just want to live your little happy delusional life working and then making money and then working and then watching TV or whatever.